Hello brothers and sisters, this is another win for the people of Africa and the continent of Africa toward a united Africa. After five months of uh, suspension of imports of goods transiting to Tunisia, Benin has lifted its suspension. And this comes after uh, one week uh, when President of Benin uh, President Patrice uh, called for relations to be swiftly uh, established between his country and neighboring Niger. So, brothers and sisters, all of us will remember that the West African uh, regional bloc uh, ECOWAS imposed the sanctions on Niger following a, a military coup on July 26, and all uh, ECOWAS members except uh, Mari and Burkina Faso, all of the rest uh, closed their border, uh, borders against Tunisia and uh, in the land, also in the air. So, and all of us, we know that Tunisia is a landlocked country, so it depends on other uh, neighbors or other countries for the imports of goods but due to the uh, to these sanctions uh niger was suspended and uh banned from imports of uh, goods uh, through the ECOWAS member states uh, those who have ports so after five months now uh benin has lifted its sanctions so and all of us we know currently that both countries uh, Niger and Benin uh, are also concerned about a giant oil pipeline that will allow Niger to sell its crude oil on the international market for the first time via the Benin port of Seme. So those who think that Africa will not collaborate, will not work together, and those who think these sanctions will add our economy as Africans they have failed and this is the African that the Africa that we want so uh, Benin has seen that these uh, sanctions or this uh, suspension is also uh, altering the economy of uh, Benin and not only Benin even the people of Africa are the same that the Benins who live in Niger also have been affected. There's companies from Benin that are operating in Niger. So if you put sanction to your fellow brothers, it is not affecting him direct or her direct, but it's also affecting you. And that is what happened here. So I'm happy now to see that now our readers started to see uh, the importance of working together. We can resolve these uh, challenges uh, through negotiation and by coming together, by sharing uh, ideas and finding solutions on the table, not to impose sanction. All of us, we, we know the effect of sanctions and what is so bad that this sanction is against our fellow Africans. So uh, Benin has seen this and have decided to lift this uh, suspension and these barriers so from now Niger can uh, import goods through uh, the port of Cotinoa and also uh, already as I said that both countries are going to, uh, to have this uh, giant oil pipeline that will allow uh, Niger to sell uh, its crude oil on the international market for the first time through a Benini port. So, brothers and sisters, this is another uh, big win for the people of Africa. Uh, those who think that it is impossible, now it looks like it is possible. The time for Africa to rethink and to see the importance of working together. Yes, we have problems, we have challenges that are facing us, but we can continue to work together to see how we can help each other to allow your fellow brothers and sisters to be suffering because of internal uh, problem of 
uh, I mean this uh, political internal problem I think that is not uh, fair so let us uh, we the people of Africa find solutions for this problem and this uh, sometimes this solution can be found uh, within uh, the country so Niger will solve their problems uh, they have heard us, they have read us, they have uh, if they fail they will consult uh, African Union and uh, other organizations such as SADC, East African Community and other even in UN but they will solve their problems so for we the least to punish our fellow brothers and sisters we are punishing ourselves we are Africans and we continue to be Africans despite of the, the challenge that we have so the time for Africa to work together to come together I see uh, that the future is so bright thank you to the government of Benin uh, for lifting these uh, sanctions or the suspension of imports of goods uh, transiting to Niger well uh, I hope uh, even other countries that has been closed their borders against Niger I think uh, will open and we want to see a united Africa we want to see a united ECOWAS not ECOWAS that is so broken we want to see uh, the free movement of people and goods within Africa within regions uh, we want to have a single currency within, within the regions within the continent so that we the people of Africa we can do business smoothly without uh, these uh, small barriers that are uh, putting us uh, backward so brothers and sisters uh, let me say thank you this is another big win for the people of Africa Viva Africa, Viva Niger, Viva Benin. Thank you.